Hi, this is EuroJPY and today it's Monday 21st of September 2015 and the time is 17.06 GMT. I'm Sofia Stavropoulou and this is a video signal for Forex ID Academy members, FXholics, Forex Signal subs users and WhatsApp Signal subscribers. I'm using Ichimoku Kinko Hio, Bollinger Bands, let me add fractals which I have forgotten to add here and stochastics. Uh, this is the daily time frame of Euro JPY and um, we see a paradox here. The leading Kumo is a bullish reversal pattern, a clearly bullish reversal pattern, flat top belly down and the bearish momentum has almost been negated, been cancelled. Um, because uh, the Kumo has been affected by this very strong upward move of the pair. But the candlesticks tell us another story. The price went up either even approaching the upper Bollinger Band on daily and then it made a double top, lower close, much lower close um, bearish reversal candlestick pattern, a swing high which is above the medium Bolger band and this candlestick closed below the medium Bolger band actually validating the pattern which is a bearish continuation pattern and the same pattern closed marginally above the body of the Kumo and it shows that the price wants to continue its fall instead of going up of course everything can happen but um, if this strong move has been um, cancelled by two candlesticks um, it's really hard uh, to see it um, uh, continuing to see the pair continuing upwards but uh, anyway we are not going to make any trading decision from the daily Although we have stochastics going down, Chikuspan having crossed below past price action going down and below the Kumo as well. Uh, remember that this move is making a bearish Kumo breakout which is validated by Chikuspan so far. And um, Kijun Sen uh, has made um, a, 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 a change of direction um, formation and now it is it is flat but if uh, uh, if Tenkan Sen angles downward uh, going down pretty soon Kijun Sen will follow and we will have the first downward stair of Kijun Sen indicative of the beginning of a new uh, of a move to the to, in, to the new direction uh, an extra validation to the bearish Kumo breakout um, uh, which we get from Kijun Sen, not only from Chiku Span. So let's go down to H4 and see if we can find a nice entry point here. So on H4 uh, I would be afraid to enter from here because I would uh, suggest that the price might want to go upwards to the medium Bolge band making a statistical validation upward move but because we had such an upward move already and the price is now going away from there um, I don't think it's a bad idea to enter here uh, but because if we enter from H4 we will have to place our stop loss above Kijun Sen and that's a relatively high distance it's actually 150 pips let's go to, to H1 looking for a lower risk entry and um, it is 85, 85, 86, 86 pips if we enter here and place our stop loss above the last uh, kids and Sand Plateau on H1 so you can enter short uh, I wouldn't tell you to wait because both Tenkan Sen and Kids and Sen are sloping downwards that shows increasing right now bearish momentum so jump in uh, at 134.84 uh, sell 
placing your stop loss at 135.71 stay in while candlesticks close below below 10 can send on h1 exit when a bullish candlestick uh, closes above 10 can send on h1 trail your stop loss a few pips above kitchen send plateaus or um, enter with uh, your stop loss uh, above kitchen send plateau and uh, exit when your take profit target gets hit uh, and place your take profit target a few pips above the lower bones band on daily and that is at 133.14 price level for now um, of course the price may go much lower if it decides to to make to continue this downward move uh, because on the weekly it rather looks like the price will continue lower than going up uh, the medium bolger bad is already uh, flat and um, if the price can't um, uh, Kent uh, uh, has found uh, such a strong resistance in the body of the Kumo on the weekly. I doubt it will um, try to, to, to move through the Kumo for now. At least not before uh, touching the lower Bollinger Band on weekly and that is at 132.95 price level. Not a bad move for all of us who are in the trade. So, this is it for now. Thanks for watching and happy pips.